So, outside walls are up, uh, brickwork, blockwork are up, um, everything's been formed, and now we're inside building stud walls. Stud walls are probably two ways they'll be built, and uh, more than likely you'll see either out of um, traditional timber or, or like a tin metal um, material, basically. They're all the same, perpendicular studs every so often. Um, the gaps vary depending on the material, but um, if it's if it's wood they'll be 400 if it's metal they'll be you know 600 um and then about waist high up you'll have one continuous one going all the way through that way so that's what you're looking out for is making sure the studs are all there you've got your these are called your noggins that go that way these are your studs that go that way making sure they're there basically uh, making sure they're there nice and strong make sure they're fixed uh, to the base plate which is the bottom one make sure they're fixed nice um, and then uh, your top plate um, make sure that's fixed as well because you afterwards you're on a nice strong wall because you could be hanging stuff off it and um, it's on a strong wall so that's it really um if for normal petition stud walls um you, you're going to be seeing that uh, again you, you're going to be wanting to see insulation as well because it acts as a, uh, as a not only as a thermal barrier um but also as a, as a sound barrier um going on to sound though so if you've got um say an on seat on suite in uh, a bedroom you're not going to want to hear someone on the toilet whilst you're in the bedroom so to to, to get rid of that sound um basically similar similar design in the center you have your stud uh, stud wall inside that you have insulation but next you'll have osb board which go either side of the stud which is um you you might know it's chipboard uh, and then on on top of that you'd have plasterboard so whereas normal stud wall, you just have your stud in, and the plasterboard with the soundproof and you have your stud, your insulation, the OSB and, and then the plasterboard on the outside. And this like sandwiched together has a much better, much better decibel rating than a Cellcon block work wall, which is traditional brick and block. So a much, much better way, quicker way. Um, and because you've got your board on there as well, uh, when it comes to hanging stuff, whether it be a kitchen or, or bathroom furniture, um, you can screw anywhere. You don't have to find a stud because um, it's just it's all solid wood. So really good way, really quick way, efficient way, uh, fast way and cheap way of, of building internal stud walls that are soundproofed.